Hello everyone, this is uh, The Book Corner. Welcome back to my channel. So I have two videos that I'm going to be uh, doing today and the first one is actually a video that I had done um, about a week ago and I had decided to delete a lot of my videos that I had on my, um, you know, I really didn't know what they were so I inadvertently deleted that review video. So I'm redoing the review video and then I've got um, a review for the cheerleader that I did finish today so I'm going to be doing that and I am halfway through uh, Witch Hunt so I probably will have that review out probably Saturday or Sunday. So one of the two days. So the review is The Whole Kit Cat and Caboodle by Sophie Ryan. And uh, she actually writes under another name. She does the Magical Cats Mystery. So yeah. So I actually read this as a Kindle edition because of the light in my um, room. But I did go ahead and buy this as a physical copy. So this is by Sophie Ryan. This is the first in a new series and it's basically, um, let's see here, um, okay. <laughs> All right, so this is basically, uh, so this little lady is found with a dead body in her back garden and she is uh, considered a suspect and so um, Sarah who owns this um, this shop she's got a, a cat that she named Elvis um, she has to try to figure out um, what is going on here and kind of try to help the lady out and I'll tell you something I don't know what's up with ha having cats that are like really super intelligent but this cat is super intelligent I found the book to be very charming and witty and very much uh, in line with uh, the magical cats I absolutely loved everything about it. Um, the ending was unexpected, and it's like I just I was just stared at and like, did I just what the heck? What the heck is she thinking doing this? Um, and. I'm just sitting there and I'm finishing with the book and I'm like, that was the weirdest ending ever, ever in my life has this been one weird ending. Um, overall, the book was, the, overall the book was pretty good. I mean, it's not as good as the magical cats but it's still pretty good so yeah so I'm going to give this uh, book four stars um, am I gonna read the second book I probably will I probably will and thankfully I can get it uh, from the library because uh, I won't be buying the second book for a while um, for people who may want to know uh, it has um, it has 27 uh, chapters. Uh, a lot of the chapters are pretty long, but um, yeah, and it's I really like the cover. I really do. All right. So that is my review for this book. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will see you guys around. Bye.